Hello everyone and welcome to another video. I know this video is a little bit late. It has been a busy week so far, but uh, let's go through Tales of Aria real quick because we all know that there has been quite some of those cards which, you know, have been driving up in price in the past two months. The last time we checked on this was, let me see, uh, September 11th. So, wow, almost three months. 181 boxes on the market. Last time we checked, there were 230. So, supply went down quite a bit. The price back then, I'm sorry, the price back then was 55, and now I can get a box for 57 shipped to my door. Let's look at the single card prices, shall we? The favorite is at 65, not much happened here. The legendaries, well, Spellbound Creepers went down, back down to 130, New Horizon 80. The average, though, is up to 65.90. We haven't seen those prices in a long time. Um, the smaller ones tend to go up in price. This, yeah, this is correct. So, Majestic Rainbow Force. Check this out. This looks like a Bitcoin chart. Channel like Frigid and Fall. Lowest price is 20 on card market. Also, Oak Old is at 8. And you can see it here. It went down from 350 to 250 to 2151. 50 cents last time we checked on it. It wasn't even on this chart. And now it's the second most expensive of all those Majestic Rainbow Force at 8. Where's the average? 359. So those two skyrocketed. Here's the non foil versions. Same thing. 434 Pulse of Isenloft. And. Yeah, well, these are the short printed ones, the non equipments and the three locations. All right, Channel Like Frigid and Non Foil is at 13, Oak Mold is at 5. This one also, second place. Um, I wonder why. I'm sorry, what the f Oak Mold is here. I'm not gonna redo this video again. 390 Oak Mold. This is the wrong order. I'm gonna put this down here, 5390. It looks kind of like this, all right? So, I'm sorry. Sorry for that hiccup. Here we go. Tom of Harvest at five, is that correct? No, it's not, it's at three. Tear Asunder is at five. Now, let's do this right, shall we? Here we go. This one's the second most expensive. Whoop, and then there's this, and Oak Mode at 390. Tom of Harvest for three. Now that looks better. I don't look shitty, especially if you, I don't know, watch it on a cell phone and it's super small. Um, but yeah, I'd like to keep these pictures on here so we can see which ones are the ones that you want to see if you open a box. And talking of open a box, this looks crazy. Right, if you open one box on average, card market low price is assumed, you will get cards of the following rarities. Common Rainbow Foil is about 30 cents. Majestic Equipments, 92 cents. The favorite, 163 per box. Majestic Rainbow Foil is 449. Has been a long time since we have seen that. Uh, one and a half years ago. And the Majestic Non Foil is at 862, highest price ever. Is this correct? 862, non equipment. Yeah, sure. Non Foil, non equipment. Uh, legendaries also went up a bit to almost 18 per box and then here's the EV so it's not an EV alert because I still think it's not worth opening a box because um, it does cost 56 57 and you'll get cuts out for 34 so it's not worth opening this to me personally for my store um, I'd rather buy collections or singer cards but yeah, 34 is the expected value. That is up from all the way back here, one and a half years ago. We've seen that EV and then it has been diving down to 22 and now it's back up to 34, just because of some of those Majestics, which are pretty much playable for Yarn and beyond. Um, yeah, well, uh, not worth opening, like I said, but it's, it's good to see this go up again. I mean, yeah, five bucks up. That's pretty nice. Um, we've seen a bump here, and then another one here. And keep in mind, Tales of Aria is the one that has been 
Oh, sorry, if the tone... Oh my, I forgot the microphone. Is it even recording? Let me see. Yeah, okay, all right. So, anyways, uh, that's it for now. That's it for EV, Tales of Aria. This one has it's been the one that has been uh, printed in much lower numbers than the first edition, which is strange. But, yeah, there you go. There you have it, 34. Thanks for watching. I'm going to be back tomorrow with the weekly What Have I Sold? And then on the weekend, I think I'm going to do another one. Thanks for watching. Have a good evening.